Hi, this is Isha the Mad Scientist. Welcome to another video from the Mad Scientist Studio. Today I thought it would be interesting to uh, compare some overhead microphones. I recently got a pair of uh, Cascade Fatheads, which are ribbon mics, and I wanted to compare them to my small diaphragm condensers that I was using previously, which were blue hummingbird microphones. So, without further ado, let's dive into it. Here they are in the mix of the song. And now you can hear them soloed up. Now you can hear them soloed with no EQ right off the board. So now that you've heard it, I'm curious what you think. Please let me know down in the comments. My opinion is that the fat heads I enjoy listening to more, especially for like loud, heavy, harsh cymbals, which is kind of what I was doing for this test. And if you're playing hard rock or uh, punk, I would definitely go with the fat heads so that the cymbals don't get like too uh, harsh. And also, if you listen closely, or rewind and listen again, you'll notice that the actual drums themselves sound way fatter in the overhead. So if you're going for like kit picture mics, instead of just cymbal mics, those uh, fat heads are gonna work a lot better for you. You could probably get away with a kick mic and those fat heads as overheads for that three mic sound, and it would be pretty rad. If you were trying to do that with the Bluebirds, it would be bright, not have much girth to the snare and the toms. Now, if I was recording something that had subtle cymbal work, if they were playing brushes, hot rods, or just softer music where I needed brighter detail on the cymbals, then I would definitely go with the Hummingbird mic. So it's not like I'm just gonna be selling those. It's great to have them as a studio owner to have both options. Um, I think that's about it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.